Okay, here we go. This is going to be really short. Um, if you start to feel sick or lightheaded or weird physically, not emotionally, if you feel weird physically or lightheaded or anything, just stop, take a break, and 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 don't do it. Otherwise, um, it's going to be super, super simple. So um, we'll start here. So standing, if you can, bring your uh, feet together with the big toes touching the ankles apart. If that's unstable, feet a little bit apart is okay. We're going to pull the shoulders back with the belly kind of pulling tight. So we're getting really good posture. So we're lengthening up through the belly to the crown of the head as the shoulders pull down. So we're giving space to the internal organs. So it's lengthening from here into here, just in our standing posture, on a daily standing posture. If you can stand as straight as you can. So we're gonna do this with breathing. The breathing will be in the nose and out of the nose. So we're gonna breathe in as we reach up and look up. We're gonna hold that breath. And then we're gonna breathe out and bring the arms down. Good. And then again, we're gonna breathe in through the nose. Hands together above the head, prayer. If we're looking up, good. We hold the breath. Out with the breath. And again, breathing in through the nose. Looking up if it doesn't bother your neck, we hold the breath in. Out with the breath, arms down. Both directions in and out through the nose. Breathe in through the nose, reaching up. Hold the breath in and out. And one more, breathe in. Hold the breath in and out. Good. So on the next part, <clears throat> the breathing we did in the beginning, we're gonna do as we're even standing still. So again, we're breathing in through the nose, we're retaining the breath, we're holding our breath, and then we're pushing it out. And then we're breathing in again, we're holding the breath, and then we're breathing out. But we're gonna do it with these poses. The first one is, you don't have to have a mat either, but we're gonna be heel to heel aligned. The back foot is flat. Heel to heel means straight line, foot to foot. You can see them better here. The knee is over the ankle in the front, the arms are up. Again, same. Belly pulls in and up, lengthening, giving space to the internal organs as the shoulders are dropping down. Same, we breathe in through the nose. We hold the breath, we breathe it out. We breathe in through the nose. We hold the breath and we breathe it out. And one more, breathe in through the nose, hold the breath, and breathe it out. So we're gonna pivot now, straight the leg, turn the right toes in to about 45, left toes out, we bend the left leg, so we're doing the opposite side of the pose, arms back up, belly reaching in and up, lengthening, giving space for the internal organs. We look at the fingers in the front, the shoulders drop down. Same thing, breath in through the nose, we retain the breath and breathe out. Breath in through the nose. Hold the breath. Push it out through the nose. And one more breathing in. Hold the breath. And push it out. Good. So we switch the feet the same as we did before. That left foot turns into 45, the right toes out. We're gonna do the same breathing with one more standing pose. So we're gonna reach out, the leg is straight, we reach beyond the straight leg. Just place your right hand gently on the shin, reach the left arm up. We're gonna, again, same breathing. Breathe in through the nose, hold, breathe it out. Breathe in through the nose, hold the breath, breathe it out. One more, breathe in through the nose, Hold the breath, breathe it out. Let's come back up. Take a moment if you need to restabilize. If you feel dizzy, we'll just stay here for one second. And we switch the feet, turning the right toes into a 45 and the left toes out. So 
We'll do the same thing on the other side. We reach out of it, not just folding forward, reaching out. Hand on the shin, right arm up. We take the breath in through the nose. And we breathe it out. We take the breath in through the nose. We hold it. And we breathe it out. We take the breath in through the nose. We hold it. And we breathe it out. Come back to center. Turn the feet so they're running straight forward. We're gonna reach the arms out. Again, the belly is tight, reaching up. Three more breaths, just like this. We breathe in through the nose. We hold the breath. We breathe it out. We breathe in through the nose. Retain the breath. Breathe it out. And one more breathing in. Retain the breath. And breathe it out, arms down. If you can stand normal, just take a break, just take a moment. Okay, the breathing is going to be the same. We're going to start from hands and knees. So, from hands and knees, we're going to take the right leg, step it up to the top. We're going to reach the arms straight up into the sky. The knees over the ankle. If your knee in the back bothers you, Get a big carpet to do it on or flip the uh, mat underneath, but you don't have to use a mat, doesn't matter. Same breathing. We breathe in through the nose. We hold the breath and we breathe out through the nose. Again, we breathe in through the nose. We hold the breath and we breathe out through the nose. Then again, we breathe in through the nose. We hold the breath and then we breathe out through the nose. Now, we take the left elbow, put it outside of the right leg, don't push the leg, pull the hands in towards your chest, turn your uh, right elbow up, just stay here. We are now twisting and squeezing the internal organs, including the lungs, a little bit. So again, the three, we breathe in, a little harder, right? Hold it, breathe out. It's harder because we're squeezing the lungs. Breathe in again. Hold it and breathe out. One more, breathe in. Hold it and breathe out. So you step back to uh, hands and knees and we're gonna do the other side. Arms straight up. We take the breath in. We hold the breath. Breathe it out. We take the breath in. Lungs are long. Hold it and breathe out. And one more, breathing in. We hold it, and we breathe out. I'm coming this way, you stay where you are. We're swinging the elbow outside, knee stays over ankle, hands pull in, turn the fingers to your face. Elbow on the left is pointing up. Same, we breathe in through the nose. A little harder, we're squeezing the internal organs. Hold it, and breathe it out. And again, breathe in. Hold it, and breathe out, and again, breathe in, hold it, and out. Okay, I'm gonna move the camera, we just got two more. The legs are out in front of us. It's as if, uh, just like when we were standing in the beginning, uh, but a little bit different. So we're breathing in, reaching up, we hold, on the out breath, we fold down. Back up, breathing in. Hold the breath and breathing out. And again, breathing in, reaching up and breathing out. Bend the right leg. With the right leg bent, we're gonna take the left arm and grab that leg, put the other hand behind you. I may look at you, but you're looking away like so, same, we breathe in, we hold a little harder because we're twisting, and then we breathe out. We breathe in again, and we breathe out. And we breathe in again, we're holding, and we breathe out. One more side, right leg is out, left foot is in, the opposite arm grabs, so we're twisting the internal organs and we're squeezing them a little here, same thing, we breathe in, and we breathe out, 
and we breathe in and we breathe out we're going to retain the last one breathe in hold all right great we'll come back around uh, we're going to do the last one and i will give you an option on the last one and you probably won't do the option but i want you that this one's a replacement for it so hang on so we want to turn the body upside down as much as we can we're going to go super mild for the first one you should be able to do this one i'll show you the other one but you may not choose to do the other one so that the easiest one is we're just laying on the back and putting the legs up the wall you can open the arms get really comfortable and we're going to do our normal three just breathing in retaining the breath and breathing out Breathing in, retaining the breath, and breathing out. And breathing in, retain the breath, and breathe out. So from here, you can look at the other pose, or you can just lay down for a couple minutes and even fall asleep if you want. I'm gonna show you the last one, which can be done either with this one or as a substitute with this one, but you may wanna skip that. So I'll show you in a second. The last one is shoulder stand. You may not want to do it. You may want to skip it, especially if the other ones really fatigued you, or maybe you want to ask your doctor if it's okay for you to be upside down like this. You can even show them the video. So start laying on the back. I like to bring the knees in, but you need a little bit of force. You put your hands under the lower back hips. You kick the feet up, stay here for just a moment, it'll reset your blood pressure. And then from here, legs straight up, full shoulder stand, the weight is in the elbows and the shoulders, not the head. Don't look at the video like I'm doing, you wanna look at your toes. And we take three breaths here. We draw the breath in, we hold, and then out. Breath in, hold, and then out, let the internal organs drop a little bit. One more breath in, hold, and then out. You can bend the legs and roll down onto your back and just lay down. You don't have to do that last pose. Call me if you have any questions.